you living day by day not knowing how this virus attacks and everything else, having to be stuck at home with your kids, which I love my kids, but they don't understand and you got to calm them down so they won't be scared. But at the same time, I don't know what's going on and I don't want to be scared. You can't live in fear. And then I'm already getting anxious and I don't want to be like that. You know, you don't want to be scared. You want to have faith in, you know, well, well, at least with me, I don't, I'm not the type of person who's like, oh, woe well, is me, doom, doom. I'm going to always be hopeful. But in the meanwhile, if they say, hold up, step back, do that, I'm going to do that. Now, if, if if I feel like I can't control myself by hugging people, I'm going to stay in the house. Mm. Now, I'm staying in the house, getting me crazy with my kids, but it's giving me a peace of mind, too. You know? That's right. So, and every day you watch the news and you got to hope for the best. Just gotten in here I after just, the Drake oh, fire, oh, oh. getting yes. moved in here. Talk about all that a little. You know something? That's, that's another thing why I'm very hopeful and I'm very faithful. I mean, not saying I'm this, well, I am a child of God. But when I was in that fire and I had my two sons with me and we couldn't even see walking out, feeling ourselves. You know, and it was on Christmas and all the dramatics of it. Some people would be like, girl, girl, I took it as a miracle. Mm -hmm. So for God to bring me out of that, when I couldn't even see, you talking about this coronavirus, I get it. But when you can't see and you literally walking through it, you just do what you're supposed to do. God will handle everything. You just got to take it step by step. And just that's how I'm looking at it. The Drake fire step by step, filling the walls. You just got to do the steps. If they say stay your distance, stay your distance. What kind of things have really been helpful to you? People, resources, the city? Um, well, my building that I just moved in, Urban Works, they've been a real blessing for me. You know, I love that they have security. I love how the building is designed. It gives me a piece of, oh, you know, it, it feels like it was made for me, just having a nice environment to be in. Um, just being able to talk to my counselors, you know, just being able to, FaceTime people and, you know, really, even though it's on Facebook, see other people having encouraging words, that's that's been the most thing you can do. You know, it ain't too much more. You know, it's just day by day. You literally taking this day by day.